to the world. Subscribe now to the Hot 97 YouTube channel. It's Ebro in the morning with Laura Stiles and Rosenberg. You said we was going to do some breathing. Do we want to wait till the gurus for breathing exercises and talking about people needing to drink water, take naps? I mean, there's always a moment for that and, at every inhale moment. Inhale and exhale. Yeah, drink some water, everybody. Sip some tea, something clean, some fruit. Cleanse your energy because it is a heavy time right now in terms of the winter. Right. You know what I'm saying? So you want to make sure your health is on point. So watch what you eat. Stay away from the mucus-forming foods. you be all right. You know what I'm saying? You'll be I all mean, right. I don't... It, it ain't going to happen in one day. No. This, <laughs> no, this is it's a, a lifetime. It's a lifestyle change. Yeah, it's this a is lifestyle a, change. a lifetime regimen. It's a lifestyle change. But people are, but and you know, look, Rosenberg got himself a Peloton. He knows he needs that cardio. Oh, man. Cash, Cash One is took a spinning class. You know, right. he needs that cardio. Laura Styles is back in boxing. She needs that cardio. No, I'm I'm about that spin. I've been about that spinning life. I love yeah, it. Yeah, you've been about that spinning life. Yeah. Be so, healthy. Laura, what are you what are you doing now for exercise? Now that you can't really get in us, are the spinning classes still happening? What? How does this happen then? It's a little weird right now because before they used to have some outdoor opportunities that I was doing, but now that it's cold, they shut that down. So now what the new thing right now, which is uh, I haven't tried it yet because I don't know how I feel about it, is um, obviously you have to be vaccinated to take the class, but you have to wear your mask indoors. Working Damn. out wearing a mask is hard. I am it's front. hard. Wearing a mask hard. during a spin class. What? Yes, taking that's a spin intense. class is a lot, so I that don't know. That doesn't sound healthy. I just I been going to my local gym, but so wait, wait. Cass, when you took, you had to wear a mask. Yeah, yeah, I had a mask How? on, bro. Let me tell you, you might pass it's out. Hard. Yeah, you just gotta, you know, get through it, man. So it's very <laughs> yo, difficult. The breathing is like, yo, it, that's why I said hard. I was like, yeah, I don't know, I felt that. but I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna keep going, man, because you know, actually, you know what? It makes it more intense, intense. Uh, yeah, for well, your lungs, so, you know. Well, so they have these masks. <laughs> Uh, that are for like high altitude training, and some people use them in in running and training that restrict your breathing because right. it, it it teaches your body how to use oxygen more efficiently. Is the idea? Is I think is, producer Griff uses it by the way. Yeah, and it, it helps it helps you improve your breathing because it teaches your lungs how to get stronger. Mm -hmm. Um, so. You know, I don't know if that's the same with surgical masks. I'm just saying, Shani, for to your point, there are people who work out in masks because it improves their breathing capacity. Right. When you're, I'm sure, more of an intense athlete. Yes. But for regular people who are trying to work out and get their cardio on, you know, that sounds pretty dangerous because your lungs need the full capacity to be able to get the oxygen. Well, if you them. have to choose between not working out at all, and wearing a mask to work out, I would go with wearing a mask to work out. Mm. Right. Because you How still about need you could also just work out in your house. You could also go on YouTube these days right. and find a lot of things you could do and not have to be with other people. Right. Let's just be real. If you people want need to. to, if you really want to, but people need that motivation. People need that motivation, and, and getting in a collective group helps the energy. I ain't gonna front. It's fun, it's more fun to work out with more people than it is to work out by yourself. But I think that's the beauty of the Peloton thing. You could sign up for Peloton to app for like 20 a month, not leave your house, and at least have people you communicate with and connect with, et cetera, if you're looking for a solution to not being in a group with other people. How's that Peloton, Rosenberg? It's good, man. I mean, I'm still just getting warmed up, man. I'm still I'm still really early in it and getting getting my legs, so to speak. You know, to It's hard, right? It's hard. The first time I did it, I was so uncomfortable doing it at all that, yeah, it was really challenging the first time. And so now... I'm definitely feeling better. It's a build. It's a build to get into the point where you could. Like my cousin yesterday posted what he did on his Peloton. I, I, I don't know how long it's taking to get to that level. I mean, what's level is this? What are we talking about? I mean, he posted his hour. He had burned 953 calories, ridden for like 20 miles. His average resistance was 51. Like he was going for an hour straight. Mm, I'm not there. Go, go at tight. your own pace. You're fine. You're fine. But no, that's the thing. I don't, I don't, I don't, to me, this is the way I look at it. I was doing no cardio. So if I now am doing mild to decent cardio four times a week, yo, that's much Life better changing. than zero. Life changing. That's, that's yo, much got better a, than zero. They got a 20 minute workout on that Peloton at the resort I was just at. I was riding the Peloton. They got a 20 minute joint on there. I did a 45 and an hour on there. That was pretty, that was dope. But they got a 20 minute on there that if you could just touch that every day. That's what I've been doing. I've only been 20 so far. I'm only doing 20 at a time to warm up. But I figure like this, if I do four or five 20 minutes a week, 
You know, you're, you're crushing talking about it, bro. You're crushing almost two, it. That's almost two hours of cardio a week I wasn't getting before. That's so right. to me, it's just like getting. I'm not doing this. You, you guys know I preach for me. Losing weight is in the kitchen, not in the gym. So for me, this is literally just about heart. Your heart that's being right. healthy. That's, that's it. right. You can't. You're not going to lose a lot of weight doing 20 minutes a day, but you will get healthier. Listen, man, this has been the health and wellness update. Wow. <laughs> Listen, it's important. It's Yo, important. I'm going to tell you, man, blood flow, breathing, all of that during all of these triggering traumatic times is something that will definitely help you keep your mental health on the right path. Right. Right. Just getting out, exercising. Go, some mm-hmm. Listen, keep some it. of y'all ain't doing nothing. I'm telling you, I know it's cold. Bundle up and go for a walk, bro. Mm -hmm. Keep that just a walk. And if you can't do that, walk up and down the stairs in your building. Yeah, you walk up and down them stairs in your building enough. That's some good work. Mm -hmm. Get your heart pumping, your lungs pumping. You need that blood circulation. I gotta post this on the Ebro Times. Hang on, man. It's a lifestyle change. At you know Ebro what? Times, if you ain't been to check it out. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be by the, you know, Ebro, Ebro, today's health and wellness e- update. If you thought Ebro was annoying with one account, now he's got two. <laughs> yeah, but the Ebro Times is specifically positive vibes and helping people. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I'm like, just laughing like, you like I don't know how long you're going to keep this up. Like yesterday was uh, Issa's human playground snowplow. You know what I'm saying? Helping clear out. Okay. The playground area with her body as she slid down the slide to make way for other kids to use the slide. You know what I'm saying? Okay. And why are we doing? Why are we doing two accounts? Or the Ebro Times pet section, which I featured you, Rosenberg, and Bear the Dog, and Rocky. <laughs> I saw that. I, I didn't. I, that was interesting. You know, today's feature it was about delving into how new roommates try to take other people's places on the couch. And you can yeah. see from Bear's face, he was not happy about Rocky's placement on your lap and on the couch. <laughs> everyone says, yo, whenever there's a picture with Rocky, my, my girlfriend's dog, everyone has a comment about who, how Bear is angry. I'm like, yo, he's making the same face as he always makes. Play along, Rosenberg. Bear's pissed. Rocky's taking a slot, man. <laughs>